Hello, hello. Hello, 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 hello. So, I'm Lynn Browner, and I paint a lot of flowers. <laughs> I have a son, Owen, who is 12, and he has autism. He helps me paint the backgrounds of our paintings, and then I paint the rest. So, I'm just going to do kind of a quick, I think, <laughs> simple painting tonight. Um... I have had a pretty emotional day with my sweet baby O, and um, just with everything, we'll just go with that. <laughs> um, he did really pretty good tonight, but he had a um, he had a great start to his morning, and then he had a rough start to his morning, or then it went to a rough. I guess it wasn't a start. Then it was rough. <laughs> I can't even think how to say it. Um, he he had slept all night and then he got up and he was talking about what was going to happen this weekend. He wants to go to the trunk or treat at our church. He wants his friend to come. Just all good things. And he was in a good mood. He spent a lot of time with me this morning and was just really good. And then they met traffic um, at on the way to school. He loves riding the bus, but sometimes it gets very hard for him. And so he um, got really upset. And thankfully, he has a um, great bus aide that just walked him through all of it. Worked, tried to calm him, tried to help him, just just all of it. Uh, but it's just, it's so emotional for me because how do you explain that traffic is going to happen when we least expect it, when we don't want it to happen, when we need it to not happen? How how do we ever get to um, just through it? What, what do you say? What do you do? And traffic is something that's so hard for him to just ever want to be around. So, I don't ever know how to get him to just be okay with traffic, because why would you want to be? But he has to be. I mean, he has to deal with it. But that's easier said than done. I mean, you, you, that's a stoplight, that's people in the way, that's traffic, that's lights, camera, action. Uh, so luckily, um... He uh, was a little bit calmer by the time they got there, and he uh, seemed to have a pretty good day at school. Um, and then when he came home from school, um, I, um, before we even got inside, I told him, I said, I'm, I'm really sorry you had a rough morning. And he doesn't always process, like, right then what's happening um, he's so brilliant. He's so beyond brilliant, but sometimes the words, the ways, the things, they just, they don't always process. He just, he, he can't explain it. He can't understand whatever it is. Well, thankfully, excuse me, thankfully, um, he was, uh, he was at that point where he was okay. And he um, gave me a huge hug and and let me kiss the top of his head that when he was younger, um, when he was small, I would, all, um, I would always lean over and kiss him on the top of his head. So he, um, he always gives me um, his forehead to, to give him the, the kisses. And so he gave me, oh, 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 oh. see the droppage. Um, so he gave me, moved in to get the kiss on the top of his forehead and then he, um, pulled away and he did it two more times. Um, and, and just for, he, he initiates hugs sometimes, but that's not always like the plot and plan for the day. So I was really excited that that's what he did and, uh, 
um, and wanted me to, you know, comfort him and, and, um, him comfort me because it was hard for me, you know, when he goes off in the bus or he goes anywhere with someone else, that's, you know, your, your, your child, your love and for someone to understand and be kind that's what we all need no matter what the situation is that's what we all need and and so for the bus aid and all of the bus staff the bus drivers the bus staff they're always so kind to us and so um just amazing with him and and I know the other kids and and so I'm very thankful for all the ones that we've ever had um and for him to be able to just like express or, or need that comfort, me need that comfort, it really made me feel much better even after that. So I keep looking for more than I want to do, but I'm, I'm truly like, I just want it simple tonight. Um, so the rest of the night went well for him and, um, I've been up since to, um, I, if you're new to my channel, I have breast cancer, and so I'm going through, um, this is O for Owen, and then L and B, um, I'm going through chemotherapy, um, and I'm on my second to last infusion before the next phase of my life, um, and so today I've been kind of, it's kind of been a rough day, but this is my rough, rough week, so, um, I, I know it will get better and I'm in it to win it. And so it will happen. So I'm leaving this as it is. So I thank you for my quick little run down there. I'm, <laughs> I'm too tired to even make sense, I think. All right. So thank you so much for watching and being, being a part of our day. Toodles, toodles.